What's going on everyone? One Doctor Genius back with another Harmony Island video and as you guys know Harmony Island recently dropped its way into Prodigy and now if you guys saw my last video you guys know that we managed to light another candle in the trial of the El Elder, the ancient one, right? So now basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna go for another trial and see what monster we can get next up in the game. Right, so over here, as you guys can see, we have the basic magical crystal which will transport us into the game. Bam, let's click on it, let's see what happens. And it seems like my hours counter went down by a lot. Jeez, how long was I sleeping for? I mean, I went to sleep when my hours counter was at 25 and now it's at 8, but okay. So right, over here, as you guys can see, there are basically three monsters which we can battle as a boss. Now over here, you guys can see the things which those monsters get. Those monsters get a 30% critical chance up, this monster gets 45% more health, and this get monster gets 35% uh, more damage. Now here's the thing, what do I want in the game? More health, right? So obviously what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go with this attack which gives me... So obviously I'm gonna go with this one which gives me possible rewards, and over here you guys can see it has a heart. So, Alright guys, so let's... Alright guys, so let's select this and click the next button. Right guys, here we go, we're basically starting off Ruined Run with this game mode, and now let's get this started. Over here you guys can see, I have my 9% um, power damage bonus and a 10% critical chance up. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna head into battle against this guy and start the game, right? Now these guys have a 35% higher damage output, so we're gonna have to be like careful. Also, there's another thing like we have the armor and stuff. So right, as you guys can see, the game is starting off over here and there is a Sazag over here, right? We need to defeat the Sazag and continue on in the game. Now there's another thing which you guys may or may not know, it's that you don't have to defeat the monsters to continue on. You just need to get past the monsters, you don't need to defeat them, you just need to get past them. I didn't know that, so while I was doing every single monster battle, my sister was skipping them. Right, so here we go, let's cast our spell Falling Star Smash on top of this guy and do 4,700 damage and insta-murder him, right? Now let's cast the same spell once again and reduce this guy's health by, by as much. Avada Kedavra, you have been sentenced to being attacked by a falling star. Uh, what? Guys, did you just see that? This monster did 4,000 damage. Right, when you're playing Prodigy normally, monsters don't do that much of damage. This is absolutely crazy. And now guys, another thing which I've heard about Harmony's Island is not only are there any different types of potions, but there's another thing in Harmony Island as well. And that thing is that we get new armor, although there are no new pets, we can get armor, which is pretty cool if you guys ask me 10 out of 10 for new armor. Pets are basically gaining their stars, and now I'm gonna like get this health bonus for my pets. And now you guys know how in my last video I tried the hard bonus, the hard mode? Do you guys know how I tried the easy mode? Well, in... So basically in this video, I'm going to be trying out a hard mode in Ruin Run, right? So let's get this started. Now basically, I need to figure out where to go, so let's first open this member chest and continue on going forward. 55 gold and a team water resist potion. Let's continue on going forward. And now guys, it seems like all of these maps are exactly the same, so you guys shouldn't have much trouble navigating around. You just need to get out of monster battles, that's all. Ooh. Ooh, what's this? Whoa, these plants jump up and down and give us gold? Yes, please, give me more gold. Okay, never mind. Seems like the plant is out of gold. Let's just keep on going up on our trip. Right, oh. Darn it. Darn it, seems like we're going to battle against these ice. Alright guys, here we go. We just landed in a battle against the Force Caller. And now, basically, this guy is 11,000 health, so it will take me three shots to murder this guy. And now, here's the thing. The monsters are doing an absurd amount of damage right back towards us, so... This is kind of crazy. This is going to be actually a pretty hard match. Alright guys, now over here we face two decisions. We can go into the green one or the red one. Obviously, you guys know I'm heading for the red one, right? Warning, this path has greater challenges but harder rewards. Let's click that continue button. Here we go, we're basically going into the red hardness mode realm, right? Bam! Here we go, we're teleported in some sort of new spooky area. Whoa, what is this? Guys, this is a completely new area in the game. I have never been here before. Alright, I want to skip this battle. Alright, seems like I'm not going to be able to skip this battle, but at least 
we know that we'll be able to like do well. This is it has greater challenges but harder rewards. Right, so let's just head down over here. I'm gonna like my health isn't too low, so I'll just take a 50% potion to gain back half of it. And seems like our opponent missed their spell, which is good. Although I do know that fire pets tend to do a lot more damage, so I kind of don't want my wizard to die instantly. Alright guys, let's cast our spell on this as that doing 4744 damage, or basically doing more than half of its health to damage to itself. And there you guys go, seems like this is that missed its spell twice, so that's pretty good for me. I guess I won't be attacked too much, and now I can actually Alright guys, there we go, we've just murdered off a Zag without getting any damage dealt to us, so basically we gotta heal up this match. It doesn't seem like the red zone is too hard, this seems pretty easy, right? Yeah, the red zone seems pretty easy guys, so far it's pretty easy. I don't know whether it's my wizard or whether this guy missed his spells, but as of right now, the red zone seems pretty easy. Right, let's continue on going forward. Bam, let's open up the chest, collect our 25 gold. Yep, we only get 25 gold, let's head up over here and see what's up. Ooh, sparkly bush. Let's see what this gives us. Ah, very nice. Absolutely nothing. Ooh, there's a member chest. Let's open this. Wow, 90 gold. Alright, let's keep on heading down. I just had one battle. That wasn't a close battle at all. I feel like I should go on with the hard mode because this place seems pretty easy. Another berry bush. Let's click on it and we get absolutely nothing. Alright. Ooh, another berry bush. Let's click on this. Jeez, this is starting to get a little bit weird, Prodigy. What are you guys doing? They're so... Ooh! Alright, guys. So, there's another thing about these sparkling plants, which means they give you a reward. If you get lucky, you guys can get potions and popcorn. And if you don't get lucky, you don't get anything, right? Now, let's keep on going across over here. And as you guys can see, we have two different choices we can make. We can go easy or hard mode. We've already been in hard mode, so let's just click on it once again. Bam! Here we go. We're being teleported through the hard mode portal. And... Avada Kedavra! We have appeared in a hard mode world, right? Here we go, we've gone into the harder mode, so this is seeming- Oh! Okay! Oh! Guys? Guys? Oh no. Aw oh, man, seriously? I shouldn't have chosen the hard mode, no! Alright, it seems like we're gonna have to battle Mr. Sensei Vu, so let's head into battle against this guy. I'm assuming it's a 3 person monster battle because of the 3 crowns below him. Nope, okay. Yep, as expected, right? So now, I'm just gonna cast like Supernova 3 times to murder them all while only taking 3% damage. So it shouldn't be too much damage. I sh just should be able to survive, that's all. I just want my wizard to survive. Let's cast our spell Supernova against this three person monster battle because I'm gonna have to do this one once again. But yeah, there we go. 4,000 damage done to all of the monsters. All of their health has been reduced by a fair bit, but all of them are level 100 and let's see what it does. It's cast this spell and it does only 2,000 damage. Really, what sort of greater rewards is this? Yeah, this Cloud Goblin is teaching his grandkids how to fight. Seems like this hard mode, quote unquote hard mode, is actually easy mode in Prodigy. I mean, this seems so easy, guys. I'm being able to finish up these battles. These monsters are doing so little damage. Is Prodigy joking? This is absolutely easy. Let's just cast our spell once again. And now, all of the monsters are almost dead. And will you look at that. Mr. Grandpa and uh, Cloud Nibbler are almost dead, right? Let's shoot them once again with a giant falling star. Honestly, if you guys think of it, like, logically, a supernova should be strong enough to murder literally everything in Prodigy, but seems like science is out the window so far. Alright guys, let's cast our spell once again, destroying every single monster, and once we've done this, we can proceed on further after collecting our stars, so I will be back once I collect the stars, the potions, and all of the other stuff. Wonderful, our battle has been finished and we survived with a decent amount of health. Our health only went down by 2000, so that's pretty nice. Seems like that guy was cut cutting some slack. But as of right now, hard mode isn't that hard in Prodigy. The warning is like, just don't enter this zone, they're better rewards. Right, I don't find this zone very hard. I think it's because of all of my potions and stuff which I've stacked up over here. But right, let's click on this potion, see what it gives us, and let's collect it. Bruh. Alright, I see a battle up over here, so I don't want to go up there yet. I'm just going to head down over here and see what's up. Alright, over here you guys can see we basically have the easy mode crystal, but I don't want to head to easy mode. Let's keep on heading up, right? Yeah, let's keep on heading up. I want to continue through hard mode, so let's murder this wizard and continue on to level red. 
Yes, I know red isn't a level, but still, I'm just saying it, guys, okay? Right, here we go, another battle. I have 14,000 health, and the opponent has a little bit more. Now, I have heard that epic attacks are very weak in this world, so I'm just gonna see how much it is. Alright guys, here we go, I just casted my spell and now both monsters are completely dead, alright? And basically we won the battle and now we can go on to the final stage of this battle in hard mode and get ourselves greater rewards I guess you guys can see. Prodigy did say that red mode has greater rewards and it's not too hard actually. Are you kidding me? There's not even a hard mode crystal over there? Really? I could have ended this battle by going down over here? Are you being serious? I did that battle for no reason? No! What? Ah, oh, come on! Well, at least we can move on to the last boss battle, I guess you guys can see that one. Bam, here we go, we've teleported in, and now there are two ways to go. We can go this direction and, like, do the battle straight away, or we can collect ourselves our stuff, right? So let's first go down over here, collect ourselves some stuff, and continue on with the rest of the battle. Alright guys, it seems like that the monster is on the other staircase this time, not on this staircase, that's pretty nice. Guess I'll just go over behind the monster, ooh. Alright, seems like the crystal doesn't work unless you like defeat the boss, so let me just click on this crystal, let's see what it gives us. It gives us 10 gold, and now, as you guys can see, Mr. Hob has spawned in, so now we need to go into battle against this guy and his 3 evolutions. And once we do that, we will be able to, like, get ourselves the next power bonus thingy. Right, so once we do this battle, we'll be able to get ourselves the heart bonus thingy, and these monsters won't be able to defeat us with such ease, right? Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cast a spell Supernova first step to do enough damage to all those monsters at once. Kapow Cabbage! There we go, we just did 5,400 damage to all of the monsters in the background. And now, over here, you guys can see... Crackle the Nebulite is currently at a decent amount of health. Both of our health is at, at the same level right now. So let me just answer this question. Bam! There we go! We just casted another spell doing 4,570 damage. And there you go! We just two-shotted that monster in the fence and... Whoa! Alright! I know they said that these guys were getting a 45% damage buff, but holy cow, did I not expect this guy to like instantly one-shot my entire health bar away? Well, I'm going, well, I'm starting to run out of food from Prodigy, and it seems like both of the monsters on the back missed us. Let's cast the spell Supernova once again and hopefully finish off both of these monsters for good. Shablamo! Here we go, we just casted another spell correct onto our enemy foes and there we go we just did 4,000 and 5,000 damage to both of the monsters so I think both monsters are dead now right we just did enough damage to kill them all and there we go we just won the final battle which we needed to complete this segment of Harmony Island and now over here you guys can see basically we have a lot of hearts we can get ourselves a new buddy or we could get ourselves a heart bonus unfortunately as of right now I got myself a potion I want the heart bonus so let's just spin this once again and hopefully we can get ourselves a heart bonus potion, right? I want the po I want the heart bonus. Are you kidding me? Seriously? All right, guys. Over here, you guys can see the po the magical crystal is now glowing. So let's click on it and let's back and let's head back over to Harmony Island, right? Here we go. Boom! We're teleporting through the portal, and now we appear on the other side of Harmony Island. And hopefully, the next candle over here should have lit itself, right? Yeah. There, you guys can. Yeah. What? Alright guys, it seems like that the second candle did not light itself, I don't know why, so let's just keep on going up over here and I guess I'll have to do another battle. Alright guys, so that's all for today's video, I hope you guys enjoyed this and if you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell and give this video a thumbs up if you guys haven't already and I will be catching you all next time. One Dr. Genius out the house, bye and have a good time.